so guys a boy Jeffrey from Jeffrey this world welcome back to a crazy ass adventure right now I now and an abandoned house that we already did a few months ago a haunted house with many food cans inside the basement especially all the furniture guys but now it's actually a huge difference than the first time so I'm gonna put the first time inside the description and I can tell you guys it will be a shock of how big the difference is by then and freaking now now I'm back to show you how it is right now a few months later this day guys so if you want to see this house untouched head over to the description check it out by yourself you will be in shock after you seeing this video now of how it was then all right smash a big ass like guys let's do this now i go through this because that's the only way in man when when we here to find a parking for my car a woman an old woman was watching through a window to us but I hope she's not going to call the ghost right now because I'm doing it I'm now going to do this very quick fam but anyways I made it to the house and make a seat this is the only way in the creepy basement of hell right now we can go through this door normal previous time I remember guys in part one we only called in by the basement door, you know. But here look at this, look at this guys, the kitchen. It's like the kitchen collapsed and there's now a lot of mother on the ground. Look at the furniture, there's actually still some furniture left behind and most of the things are actually gone or cleaned up by probably my family or something. Yo, where is this? There's the kitchen. Yeah. Great. Yeah, and this is almost collapsed like crazy. Yeah. Here it is. Check this out. It's almost empty. Piece of furniture is still here. But like the pictures and other stuff are gone, guys. That's actually pretty sad. Some old newspapers piece of it actually <laughs> I remember this table was filled with all porn movies <laughs> that's actually funny check this out even all the clothes are empty <gasps> so sad but sometimes it's very cool to go back to places to see how it is how it was then and now just like this I remember at this room there are actually some very creepy pictures standing on on this, even on this closet. And now it's all gone. Uh, what the heck is that red button here? <laughs> Yo. Yo, the sleep room of hell, man. What the hell? Yo, old glasses. And old toots. Oh, man. Fam, this pretty awesome all the trophies are still behind look at this there is a lot of trophies man everything is still here what the hell check the DK and check the ceiling guys it's crazy even here was a lot of photos and other stuff like statues you know many paperwork was in the closets some blankets as well i remember that guys but now just some empty yeah check this out i remember i don't remember this actually but <laughs> we probably saw this in pardon as well i'm not for sure anymore it was a very long time ago guys so yeah this won't be a long ass video because like you can see it's all gone guys so yeah here was actually a lot of clothes hanging probably on the walls I think I'm not, not for sure anymore but I remember there's, there were a lot of clothes alright time to explore the second floor right now fam we need to do it very quick right now Ooh, that's quick hell of me Ooh. another 
red room, creepy room. Yo, there's an old soldier. Yo, from, from World War One. What the heck? Right, I'm gonna show you now the first floor. Check this. This place is a little bit haunted. I'm gonna explain later why. And I've got a concomer as well. Maybe we did this place at night. This room is still like it was a few months ago. Many, many um, portraits from Jesus. I like can see some old cool pictures. This clothes was filled with clothes as well. Now nothing anymore. Paintings are crazy. Some pills. Medicines. This house was from a woman that was pretty sick. And we found some oxygen bottles here. But I think it was not this room. There's a room. That was the room where we found that. And we bought had actually a very, very nice vibe here. Oh man. This bathroom took the hell out of me. Yeah. And uh, what the heck is this? Yo, this is weird. She probably dies here or something. And there's actually the attic, but I don't know how do we get there. Ooh. This house gives me the chills, man. Three sleeping rooms. One downstairs and one, two on the upper floors. That we are now. Ooh. But here was actually a bed, I don't know where the heck the bed is. But this here was the attic. I didn't show the part one, so I'm not going to show it to you today as well. Look, you can see that the clothes were filled with clothes. Extra pieces left behind. It's crazy. I'm still a shock to see how big the difference is. I know guys, this won't be a long as video, but I hope you understand. So like I said, if you want to see part one, check out the description. Then we will find this abandoned house that we explored at night time. That is haunted as well, with everything left inside, and it was literally untouched, guys. And now you can see it is all gone, but there's still some things left behind, some pieces, you know. All right, this door was basement. All right, before they go inside the basement, this door was open, and this literally slammed like crazy, guys. I was standing here like this. Talking to Rodrigo and then this door slammed like crazy and I've got it on camera as well. Smash it like, subscribe to my channel. What? I can hear from you. Yo, that door has just opened. Yo, look, 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 look. This house is freaky haunted. And I'm not kidding guys, I swear this house is a little home because part one we heard some crazy things as well and especially to seeing this door slamming behind me was actually insane Alright, the basement and I remember guys from the basement that this part here from the basement was filled with many many cans of food But now they actually, you see, you can see two sacks. They put some stuff inside, and they actually busy with cleaning the house. And I think personally, they gonna demolish this house very soon. That's why they cleaning the whole house. I think. Check this, guys. The basement was very creepy as well. This painting from a hunter or something. It's 
So we start to see the difference from now and then. At least there are some furniture still here, you guys, in the basement. What makes this amazing? It's creepy at the same time. Check this. Oh. Alright, previous time, this was actually the only way in. Now, I went inside the house from the door. Here and previous time, this was actually the only way in, and now we use this as the exit today. But if you enjoyed this video, guys, smash a big ass like. I know it's a very short one, but I can see there's actually not that much left inside anymore. Was well, actually pretty sad. At least I'm glad I went back to it, so we now can see the difference between then and now. I knew it would literally be a shock like I am right now guys. Alright, enough talk right now, let's get straight to another destination. But first of all, don't forget to smash a big ass like, don't forget to subscribe as well. And yeah, thanks for watching guys, thanks for being part of this journey and I'm gonna see you in another crazy ass adventure. Peace.